Thank you. With the Democrats pushing through the nomination process now with Vice President Harris, what does it mean for people turning out to vote in this year's election? The man with the answer is Ray Urena. He is joining us live now in downtown Greenville. Ray, what can you tell us? A political expert says that young people and Democrats are more likely to turn out now that President Biden has dropped out of the race. So we came downtown to Greenville to ask people how this could affect them. It gives me more energy. Uh, I didn't like the feel um, at first. I was going to vote for the other candidate anyway, so it didn't. It, did, it does not influence me. Differing reactions from people regarding how President Joe Biden dropping out affects their view on this year's election. I think as it was so abrupt, and when something is abrupt, it kind of catches your attention. The president on social media announced Sunday he is stepping aside and endorsing Vice President Kamala Harris in the race. We had, in my mind, not so good options. Uh, so this give us another, this give the American people another option to consider. Winthrop poll director Scott Huffman says the move could mean more people at the polls. You had a lot of double haters, uh, people who were, you know, dissatisfied, didn't want Trump to be president, but didn't like Joe Biden either. They thought he was way too old. Huffman adds this is something Democrats needed to counter expected high turnout from Republicans. The horrible assassination attempt against uh, former President Donald Trump, that almost ensures that every single Trump voter is going to show up in November. Voters agreed. I think the people that are going to vote for Trump are going to vote for Trump and they don't need any more energy than they already have. Huffman says there's one thing he says that could threaten that momentum. Kamala Harris has not truly been crowned the nominee. And if you have a fight at the convention, then that could flip right back and have those young voters turned off again. The Democratic National Convention will be held starting on August 19th in Chicago. Live in Greenville, Ray Reyna, WYFF News 4.